Hi folks, uh, if you're just a homeowner and want to do some rooted cuttings and you're having difficulties, uh, one of the things that I find is the most difficult issue is keeping the plants moist until they develop their own root system. This is a cheap and easy way to do it if, you're, uh, if you don't have an expensive intermittent mist system just for a normal person. This is just a regular fish tank. I think it's a 10 gallon tank. It doesn't have to hold water, it just has to be there and hold moisture inside. So inside the tank, I have my rooted cuttings inside of a dollar store flat, actually another dollar store flat beneath it, and sand. The sand I bought at Lowe's, it's just cheap sand, nothing special. Can I dip my toes in it? If you would like. So we'll remove that for a second. There's the bottom pan, just has water in it to be able to keep the uh, moisture inside. A homemade, really cheap, jinkity little stand. And then the plants. So the two main things you wanna watch out for is you don't ever wanna have this in direct sunlight because if you do, you'll burn up the plants. You also don't wanna have it too shaded because if it's too shaded, this will be all covered with mold and uh, it'll just, it'll kill them before they have a chance to even start. So I keep it on my back porch where it gets some sunlight right up against the house, but not too much sunlight. Uh, all I do is once a week, I'll pull the top off, spray this with water, check and make sure there's no standing water, that there's a little bit of moisture in there. I'm sure there's moisture testers you could use if you want to go that far, but I don't. I just make sure there's a little moisture in there and five minutes, whatever it takes, uh, once a week, check it after about 12 weeks these are pachysandra in about 12 weeks these will be fully rooted and ready to be planted out uh, i'll probably have to cut these short because we're now in the middle of october and they just i want to get them in the ground so, so you you won't leave them out here in the sun You'll oh put yeah them. i just brought them out here just so we can see what we're doing but they're going right back on the porch in the partial shade and uh, out of the sun and for me to know those would grow for me what would i have to do Oh, the only way they're gonna grow is if you like and subscribe. <laughs> Otherwise, they're just gonna wilt and die. Sorry, that's just the way it is, folks. Thanks for watching, have a great day.